All right, so in this tutorial, we are going to see how we can make this road with fly. Here we have some road materials and textures already made and downloaded from Quixel Mega Scans. So, the first thing first, we are going to switch this mode to the landscape mode. And in Manage tab, we are going to click on Spine. So, to kick off your spine, press Ctrl plus left click to add a spline and continue shaping it to your liking. Next up, head over to the details panel, locate segments, scroll down to the landscape spline meshes and hit the plus icon to add your road mesh. And we are going to add our road mesh here. And don't worry if you can't see your road, we are going to adjust and you can see your road. Now scroll back up and click on the control point. Adjust the mesh's vertical offset by increasing it by 10 units. However, if you find that your mesh isn't aligning the way you want, worry not. We can easily tweak its direction for a perfect fit. And in order to do that, click on segments, scroll down. From spline mesh, open up the index. And change its axis to Y. There you go. So in order to make it more in detail and you probably be thinking like how we can add another road in this road. For that just quickly made a curve out of this road. Select the point in this curve and right click and drop this point. Select this point we have just created and join this next right to this point. Increase its length by doing the same process. For making the road visible, we are going to adjust the mesh vertical offset in the detail panel to the 10. So you probably thinking how we can figure out this mess and get a clean road. For this, we are going to make a little adjustment in the blueprints. Now press Ctrl plus space to open up the content browser and open up this material. But before that, we have to click these spines. Now we have seen which spline has been using in this curved road and we are going to replace this mesh and for this we are going to go to the details panel head over to the spline meshes open up the index and add material override add this road in the material override as you have probably seen that we have figured out our problem but uh, we have we still have these lines go to the scale right behind to the material override and instead of 1, we are going to use minus 1 property. We have successfully hide this line and we are going to do the same for the other road. Ladies and gentlemen, here you can make a road with spline in Unreal Engine 5. Do not forget to follow up this channel for more quick tips and quick tutorials. And I will come back with an awesome video very soon.